Welcome to Rover, where today we're going to be talking about our top five filming locations in Scotland. Play the music. So, our top five filming locations in Scotland, or more specifically, the Highlands of Scotland. Um, trying to pick five is a bit like trying to choose your favourite child. Um, it's not easy. But I guess one of the ones that's right up there is, is probably going to be the Kerrang on the Isle of Skye. If you've never been to the Isle of Skye, it is the most fantastically beautiful place. Regardless of the weather, there's always something to do there. And the Kurang is, well, it's a, it's a landslide, actually, um, with a very, very sheer face and beautiful peaks. Um, I was very lucky enough to be filming up there um, for various different projects, but I guess the best of those was uh, Transformers the last night in 2016. Uh, we shot all over uh, the UK, um, and that was one of my favorite locations. The light was just stunning, uh, and we got ferried about in a helicopter, which was, uh, which was even better. Um, but the Kurang is just, it's absolutely beautiful. It's right up there. Um, I think next on our list of the top five filming locations in Scotland would be Staffin. Um, Staffin is a small hamlet not far from the Kerrang, right on the eastern uh, side or northeastern side of uh, Sky. The coastline there is just stunning. The beaches are pure white sand um, and it's one of the only places in, in Scotland where you can actually see dinosaur footprints on the beach. Um, so it's a, it's a particularly special special place. Um, we did a load of scouting there for the um, Harry Styles Sign of the Times video and that's actually where it was shot uh, in the end. So they were obviously uh, obviously pretty impressed with the aerials there. Um, where else? Uh, Glencoe obviously um, it's got to be it's got to be right up there uh, the drive through Glencoe um, from Tyndrum through to um, uh, through to Fort William is just absolutely uh, beautiful towering mountains either side of you again doesn't matter what the weather um, it's a really mystical special place um, people flock from all over the world there um, Rover have been lucky enough to shoot there on a, a number of projects um, VFX plates for features and dramas um, that have gone all over the world and it's, uh, it's, a, it's a special special place to be no matter what the weather um, where else? Uh, Coral Beach, again on Sky near Dunvegan on the eastern side of Loch Dunvegan. Uh, Coral Beach is beautiful. You could be in the Caribbean. It is absolutely incredible. Um, the water is blue. Um, it's called Coral Beach because of the, the, the white shells there. Um, the, the, the sand is just amazing. Again, that was one of the locations we scouted for the Harry Styles video. Um, and it is just an absolute stunning spot to shoot your your production. Um, top five. Where else? A bit of a bit of a curveball here for you. Strathnairn. Um, Strathnairn runs sort of parallel with the Great Glen from uh, Fort Augustus uh, in the south at the uh, the end of Loch Ness by the Caledonian Canal, um, right up towards uh, Inverness and then beyond to um, Culloden Battlefield. It's the route of the the River Nairn essentially. Um, and along Strathnairn, there are several places which are simply stunning to film and they're off the beaten track as well so if you're doing something that if you've got to shoot that's uh, particularly sensitive we don't want to be bothered by members of the public um, Stratton End is, is fantastic for that uh, beautiful panoramic views back towards um, Ben Nevis uh, and uh, all the mountains around Fort William um, and it's a, a, a really special place to be there's a nice little knife edge ridge that looks really good with a with a runner going along it and Rover has shot there as well. Um, that's one of the locations that we've we've suggested for a number of uh, number of productions. So that's our top five. Um, we'll have to do another one of these with the top ten because um, we could go on forever. Anyway, 
Catch us on the flip side. Cue the music.